the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. <laughs> We're saying the Holy Spirit, which is God, right? Yeah. Is inspiring these people, not an angel. Are you right? With, are you understanding the words that come out of my mouth? <laughs> but it, it's easy to refer back to the scriptures because you know, when Jesus dealt with the devil, he went by what is written. Yeah. And anytime you come off, to, here's a, I guess I really want to say this. Anytime you come off of the word to try to explain something to people, you, you really don't, you lose in credibility because you're based on your opinion. Oh, yeah, because it's, it's coming from your inner life. Yes. Def and definitely. And, uh, <laughs> Go ahead, brother. You, you cannot, you cannot <laughs> defend. You cannot. So, you cannot. Which is why I uh, I, I agree with what this, this young lady was talking about, and I think just from the little bit I heard, you know, uh, people are not finding God in the church. They're not finding any representation of Jesus Christ in their church. They're finding uh, pastors, teachers, teachers, evangelists, prophets. They're finding them in the church, yeah. but they're not Jesus Christ in the church. And they're, they're finding not... their opinions from it. Right. They're finding they get it. So, so uh, anybody yeah. who can, read, can take these scriptures and get up and talk about what's written in. But very few can talk about the spirit. Mm -hmm. The spirit of the word, right? The Holy Spirit to reveal. Like Jesus, he took talk to those Pharisees when they talked about, you know, uh, I speak a lot. Yeah. And he, yeah, yeah. The letter. Yeah. There, there's yeah. In the letter, you know, not to not to commit fornication. Come on, now. The spirit of the law, even to look upon a woman. <laughs> come on, now. come on, come on, come on. No, it's it, it, to, to, to miss that law. Right. You know, that's a spirit of the law. So whether you think you're doing it or not, you're not. Right. Period. Right. You, you, you cannot live according to the law because the law was written to show that you can't. not. And to bring about sin. Yes, sir. And, and, if you and, don't know sin, then you need to be taught that sin exists, or you're living according to your righteousness. Exactly. So, you there was no way for man to understand their unrighteous and fallen state without the law. Exactly. I was given to show that, and even in our arrogance, that, there you talk. It's given. We're like, oh well, we got that. That was a sin. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> that was a sin, right? Right. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and that's what I'm saying. You know, that's why he was telling people, don't be so quick to judge. Matter of fact, I had this, uh, you know, we all got to the word in it. I had this script up here I wanted to show. Well, I'm using the wrong thing. It's uh, right here. Look at this. I, you read this for me, if you don't mind. I like to hear some faith comes back here, and I, I read it for myself. But I, mm -hmm. I, I like to hear somebody else read it. Read that for us. Luke 6 37. Judge not, and you shall not be judged. Well, Again, and you shall not be condemned. Well, and you shall be forgiven. Well, Give, it shall be given unto you, good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over, shall men give into your bosom. Well, so with the same measure that you meet with all, it shall be measured to you. Well, now, let's right there and say this yes sir if you go by what is said before yeah how do you put money in this 
Uh-huh. If it's talking about judgment and well, forgiveness, then it's talking about judgment and forgiveness with the good measure pressed down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so there you let go. Me, let me let me go on six thirty nine. And he <laughs> and he spake a parable unto them. Can the blind lead the blind? Well, are they not both fall into the deep? Well, disciple is not above his master, but everyone that is perfect shall be as his master. Come on, his master, <laughs> not not above. Come on now, come on. And why beholdest thou the mote that is well, in brother's eye, well, but it is not the being that is in thy own eye? That big old pole. <laughs> let, let, me, let me bring this back. Let me rewind and put his finger back. Let me spin his back. We are right back up to judgment, condemnation, and forgiveness. Yes. This is all talking about the same we are not talking about finance nope. <laughs> nope. nope but when you you get to luke 638 that little piece is pulled out and finance is tied to it. Yep. yep every single time yes this is to the point of love thy neighbor yes that's it. come on brother Come on. So let me go. 42. Either, either how canst thou say to thy brother, brother, let me pull out the mold that is in thine eye, uh-huh. thou thyself behold, beholdest not the being that is in thine own eye. And what does he call you? Oh, hypocrite. Wow. <laughs> Here we go. Jesus is good to call some folks some hypocrites. <laughs> That's what he's saying, the hypocrisy. When you sit there, that's the problem when you judge people and you you, you become a hypocrite and you do it the same. As soon as you open your mouth to condemn somebody else, to judge somebody else, you are right there in the ministry of hypocrisy. That's the hypocrisy. Because you are not without sin. Come on now. Come on. That's why he either stays with the word. What does the word say when you minister to people? You say, hey, man, I ain't tell you I'll arrive. I'm going to tell you what the word says. Yeah. <laughs> so cast out first the beam out thy own eye. Uh-huh. Thou thou see clearly to pull out the moat that is in thy brother's eye. And you know what I like about that? Is that is that pull out. By the words of your testimony. Come on, brother. Come Only on. one you're going to be able to pull it out. Yeah, brother, let me tell you, I know exactly where you are. I was there, and let me tell you how God got me through, what he did for me. That's how you pull that boat out. Yeah. It is not by your yeah. ability, your yeah. strength, your, your your technical expertise. Come on. Come on. So, this is a great, 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 great message here. This in and of itself, this word. Yeah. Because we just free some people up with this giving. Yeah. You know, oh, yeah. trying to say that this is finance. No, we're talking about loving your brother, loving your neighbor, loving your sister yeah. as mm-hmm. yourself. As so yourself. Yeah. that's all this is talking about. Right. Well, is it in the beatitude? I don't know if the beatitude now, but it says it. You give mercy. You get mercy by giving mercy. You see what I'm saying? Is those those that measure you're talking about? I want mercy. I give mercy. Right. If, but look, if I condemn, I get condemned. Yes. If I judge, I get judged. Yes. That's the way he's trying to tell us. You want, I want people to get, I read it shaking over in mercy. <laughs> I want it shaking over in forgiveness. I want it shaking over uh, me and giving my bosom those things that will benefit me by me giving it back to them. Yeah, man, this is, this, this is worth waking up to. Thank you, Father. Amen. Amen, brother. 
So that's what I was just trying to say. So you was written because that's the only answer we're supposed to give people. And we're not disrespecting nobody. That's what you want to be tell but I'm not disrespecting you. I'm going to tell you what is driving my message, my witness. And, that, and on top of that is, the, the, what that girl was saying is, people, when they get off message, people can't find Jesus. That's what that girl was trying to say. You get off message, they can't find Jesus. So you if you, yeah, how could they find Christ if you ain't, if you ain't showing? You ain't, you ain't showing Jesus, right. I'm not pointing out Christ. And just the fact, the proof of that is what we just read. Amen. Yeah. 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 What is Christ in that? That you're going to change those scriptures into financial gain. Look how we did it. That, that, that right there is exactly what that young lady was talking about. Yeah. 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 When it becomes, when the word becomes, uh, a form of uh, business. Yeah. When, when the church becomes a business and not a not a uh, uh, I, I want to say not a school because not you go to right. you're going there to be perfected. Yes, sir. You yes, sir. I, you know, I, you know, last week we talked about a couple of weeks ago, and brother uh, Chris was here. We were talking, and going to church is like going to a washing machine. And, and, and he kept saying, "You hey, got a lot of us in a wind cycle. <laughs> we, we're not getting washed. We, 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 we think we'd have been washed, and then we're going through the wind cycle, and, and we don't realize you need to keep getting clean." <laughs> But, hey, look, the reason I'm saying that is look at this, look at this one right here I told you. <laughs> I, we did before. If you look at this one, the reason I'm not going to, I think we should stay in the Word, stay in ministry, stay in the gospel, and preach the gospel, is because verse 11, how do, you, how do you get washed? How do you get, how do you get sanctified? How you get justified? It answers yeah. in the scripture. Oh yeah. You are justified in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the Spirit, Spirit. of our and of our only God. through Christ. Can only. This only because in and of yourself, we we are as filthy rags. It's filthy rags. You say I. Uh huh. As soon as we say I. Yeah. It, 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 you you instantly show your flesh. Yes, which, sir. Which is not of God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But what we uh, do is show the spirit that's within us, which is of Christ. And you can only do that through Christ, yes, by the spirit of God. And that, that, that right there is, is the bottom line. Yeah, and that's why I say that's why you want to you don't want to kick people out of the ministries, and that's what we got into. We're doing the same thing that they did with Jesus uh, and, and, and the Sanhedrin were kicking people out of the church if they don't agree with them, right? You know what I mean? If they agree with Jesus and they tell them they agree with Jesus, they say you got to get out. They put them out, right? Uh, the, the the blind man. You remember that? They, they, what did they do? What about the, the crippled man? The brothers brought that man in healed. He was that way from birth. And what did they do? They kicked him out. They kicked him out. Who gave you the authority to heal? <laughs> this this dude. Quit, quit using that man. <laughs> right. And, and the man said, this is a marvelous thing. When you ever heard somebody born blind <laughs> can see? Yeah. <laughs> this is marvelous. I don't know whether a man is sin or not. I don't know if he's a sin or not. I don't know. You the one telling me. I don't know. All I know is I was blind, but now I see. Or the lame man. <laughs> you know, that dude got up. Lame man, 
Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and that's the difference I'm saying is when he sit there and said, man, why you carrying your mat? And he said the man put the put the mud in my eyes and, and, and told me that when that was the mud, no, he just told him get up and walk. That was, that was walk. Yeah, yeah, that's the other one. He said get up and walk and I'm walking. Yeah. But why so, you walk on the Sabbath day? Because I'm not walking for the Sabbath day. When the apostle said, don't look at us like it's us. It ain't yeah. Like this is some pop no, this is that same man that you crucified is the power that rose. <laughs> exactly. I was thinking about the lame man that was uh, by the well, but for that's oh, right. Yeah. The gate. Right, the man at the gate came praise and worship of God. Yeah. And they you know wanted, yeah. <laughs> And look how quick people want to put it on you. Yeah. You know? But look how quick they turn it around and point it to, in the right direction. In the right direction. And that's my point, I guess I'm saying, is that's the same thing for ministry. Yeah. That's why the person said, I can't find Jesus, because you're not pointing to Jesus. You're pointing to a doctrine. You're pointing to a political position. You're pointing to a health condition. You're pointing, you're pointing to all these other things instead of pointing to Jesus. And so, look, and then I close with this. Some people put people out because they say they're unrepentant. Because they're feeding on the person, they're putting the onus on the person instead of recognize the power that comes through Christ. You see what I'm saying is, I'm changed not by me. That's why I'm showing those scriptures. I am not sanctified by me. I am not justified by me. I am not washed by me. He washed me. He sanctified me. He justified me. And he justifies you. So when his isn't that a danger when you sitting there trying to desanctify? Yeah, disqualify. I, yes. oh, who who are you? Who are you? That's the point. That's why we gotta watch out for is don't don't forget where you came from. And don't forget who is doing the work in you. It's and the Holy Spirit. Some of you. <laughs> huh? Except for some of you. Except, see, I love that scripture. That was in that scripture we just read. Yeah. Not for some of you. But Man. you are wise, see? So I'm just saying, that's why I would I really have to me, I'm like, look, I'm gonna give mercy because I got mercy. Yes. All right. And I, and, and then when people see those type of things in you, they see Jesus in you, and they'll listen to what you have to say. And then if you just stay with the message, stay with the word, you will be more effective than your opinion. Yes. Now your testimony is the word, but your testimony is saying what the word did, what he did for me. Yeah. And that's a blessing. That because is a blessing. Eventually, that's what they're going to do. What the Lord done for me. Isaac can't heal. Isaac can't save me. Isaac yeah. can't heal me. We, we all kept telling. We kept telling them, huh? This is what I can do. I can point. Come on, brother. There's yeah. God. There's Jesus. This Jesus. You know? All about Jesus. You, you remember we kept, <laughs> hey, you remember we kept telling Brother uh, Elder Johnson, Elder Johnson, you ain't going to the hospital to heal nobody. <laughs> when the hospital being used by Jesus, he's going to heal. He's yeah. going to be the one that's going to bring people out of their mysteries and anything else. You, you go, why are you going? <laughs> see, see, that's what it is. You got to watch out what you're trying to do. Stop trying to be put it back on you, it's always got to be pointed toward him. He gives the glory. All that nice furniture I see back there with Brother Addison, if God ain't getting the glory, you can watch out. <laughs> yeah. Because it's him that gave it to you. Yeah, through him. Yes, I sir. Can, uh, I can tell you, uh, when, I, I know it's, it's a great thing to want the desire to do good. Uh -huh. 
but sometimes your desire to do good can be bad. Yes, sir. Because you know you you can't you can't, and this is just a, a, a it could be a bad example. You can't give crackhead money and expect you go <laughs> that money is gonna change that that crackhead is gonna go get some crack and smoke. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So yeah. giving them good for a good purpose, they'll turn around and use it for bad, but you could be killing that individual. Right. You know what I'm right. So every good thing is, is is may not be good. So you have to be led by the spirit. And that's and how you want to do it. Yeah. yeah. You can expect it. You can expect God to show up and to to have the provision for the vision that was shown. So right. um just stay focused. That's that's what I'm saying. Just point it always to ministry. Hey, let's let me close out with this for everybody. Ministry point towards Jesus. Believers yeah. who've been equipped by the saints, by the ministry gifts to do the work of the ministry. Your work is to do what? Point toward Jesus. Yeah. That's all we put. We we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up with that. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna wrap our discussion today. Is to say, don't forget, point toward Jesus. Amen. And I say that's what makes it go. Don't judge me. Amen. All right, good brother, your prayers out. Good, good. Well, Father, we we thank you again, as always, for this particular setting for it to be able to uh, tie us together so that we can see one another, so that we can be on one accord, we can share your word, Lord God. We thank you that you were here. We thank you that Christ is here. We thank you that the Holy Spirit is here. We thank you the Holy Spirit bringing revelation of your word, Lord God, so that we may apply it to our lives so that we can live a victorious Christian life, so that we can be Christ-like. Uh, we promise to always get into your word, Lord God, and uh, allow you to show us what you would have us to learn, Lord God. Not by our means, not by our thoughts, not by our revelation, but by yeah. the revelation you shall give us, Lord God. We truly, truly thank you for all those who were able to uh, view this, all those who will view this. Yes. And that it will be a blessing to them, Lord God. We don't not we don't want to offend anyone, Lord. No. We just want to share the love that you have shown us, Lord God. Okay. And we also, Father, want to just pray for those who may need to know you that a laborer is in the midst. Yes do the work, Lord God, and that it is one that can be received. And we thank you that the Holy Spirit shall bring all truth with all simplicity, with all understanding, Lord God, so that we may get to know you better and to know ourselves, our yes. new creation. We give you all the glory and all the honor and all the praise. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen, amen. Hey. 